Hello, this is Sharon Lorraine, and I'm coming to you here from the beautiful Sunshine State. And folks, I just want to stop by a real quick to talk to you, to all my peeps, to my audience out there. Um, you know, as a matter of fact, the growing concern about this coronavirus that's happening. So, you know, um, it is just, it is something that's going on that we all have to be, you know, um, aware of and take precautions now you know the flu season right every single year the flu season arrives I mean whether you like it or not this has been going on for a, a number of years now so no matter what we do it comes without fail and we all have to be subjected to the possibility of not being well right of, of getting sick so to speak so you know and some of the symptoms that you know that you're getting sick is that, you know, you start coughing, you know, the sniffles, the sneezing, and, you know, and so forth. These are some of the symptoms. Symptoms You feel your body, achy body, and so forth. So here's the deal. Now, if these symptoms that you're feeling is getting any worse, it's not getting any better, um, you definitely want to take that into consideration that you're not well and for you to go, you know, make an appointment and see a doctor, right? So, you know, um, as a matter of fact, you know, nobody wants to get sick and we all do everything that is in our power to try to avoid getting sick, you know? So while viruses may be stronger and more widespread than they were before, they are still natural. I mean, you know, people are getting sick and it is a fact of life. I mean, we can't it is what it is once you're born into this world you know um, you are prone to sickness and disease okay but how often um, do you get sick that's a good question this is a question that should be on everyone's mind all right you should really pay attention to your body what your body is telling you and you know to take a closer look at yourself the immune system can only go on fighting for so long. Let's say if you get sick, yet in naturally, I mean, automatically, the Im immune system comes into play. And what happens is that if you have good immune system, it's going to fight off anything that is foreign going on in your body, all right? You probably might um, get high fever, you know, the temperature of your body feels warm to the point that if you're really, really sick and the your immune system is so low, then of course you're gonna have fever, which is anything over a hundred is very dangerous. You ought to get that, um, you know, see your doctor about all of that. So now, um, again, back to this corona virus that's happening. Okay, like as I said, please pay attention to your body. Now, it is only time to start getting concerned if you're getting sick very frequently. Let's say um, you have a high fever, it's not going away and all of that. You know, definitely, you know, that's not normal. And it shows that your body is not functioning correctly and that your immune system is indeed not in tip-top shape, which means you are not in good shape at all because if whatever is going on and, and you find you're not getting relief from it, then it is it is getting serious but what is beating your immune system down you have to ask the question why you know are the viruses getting stronger or, or is it just overworked i mean your immune system is being overworked now all of that you have to definitely take into consideration now it comes a point of time uh, in your life that you have to like as i said pay attention to your body um make sure that you know you see a doctor and make sure that you get checked out to um so that nothing nothing worse happen now there comes you know like as i said the environment is not solely to blame for the sicknesses all right that you're so that you're suffering from when you put your your body could not be contributing to your health so much so that your immune system could be so fatigued and you're getting sick every other week or every day or you know you see this has been going on which means simply that something is happening in your body folks my encouragement to you is that 
you know, if you find these things are going on and going on with you, you definitely need to make an appointment, see a doctor, you know, if you're getting worse, go to the emergency room, but take good care of yourself, take good care of your body, okay, um, this is Sharon Elaine, I'm coming to you here from this beautiful Sunshine State, and I am in my, you know, the comfort of my home, you know, I'm working from home, um, please, if you don't mind, you know, do me a favor, hit the bell, and as well as, you know, um, subscribe to my youtube channel i will drop the links of all you know what i'm doing at home and feel free to check it out feel free to call me my phone number is 352-805-9846 352-805-9846 please call me text me um let me hear from you okay and promise me this one thing that you will take care of your body you will take care of your health Okay, until my next video, this is Sharon Arane signing off. Take care. Bye for now.